I was mindlessly scrolling on YouTube, as everyone does, and I noticed this feature called Play Tables. After diving a bit deeper, I found out that these were essentially just mobile games in YouTube. As a matter of fact, more than 75 games are available to play directly on YouTube. But now you may be thinking what I was thinking. What is YouTube, a well-known video platform, have anything to do with mobile games? And I feel like nobody is talking about this, and this is just going under the radar. But I wanted to figure out if there's any bangers being cooked up by YouTube right now. I'm gonna try out a few of these games on YouTube and see if YouTube was cooking, or absolutely not. Here's the first thing I saw, it's called Playables. There's a home and a browse option. When you go to home, it just shows you the most popular games. And then browse, it kind of shows you everything that's available. And there are a lot of games. There are things up from basketball, Angry Birds, Beat games, bottle jump, it's just too many of them. A lot of these games are kind of like uh, like mobile game ad type games. I'm gonna try this one called Brain Out. Never heard of this before. Welcome back. It's a daily reward thing. So people are playing this on the, regu on the regular, huh? Find the biggest one. I'm gonna go with the watermelon. It is the watermelon. This reminds me of like the, uh, the impossible game. I don't know if you guys remember that. This game was actually pretty boring, I'll be honest. It was just doing the same task over and over again. It got pretty repetitious and I really like it. Count the number of hairs. All right, so we have one, two, three. I'm done playing this game, man. I don't care what you guys say. I don't care what you guys think about puzzle games or... It was a cool puzzle game. No, it wasn't. That game was lame. It reminded me of the impossible game that was made back in God knows when, maybe like 2010. Hold on, I'm curious. Impossible, oh, impossible quiz, I think. That's what it's called. Impossible quiz, man. 2007. This is pretty much a bootleg version of this, which was made back before. I'm pretty sure most of you guys were even born. This game's lame, giving it a two out of 10. The puzzles, some of them are interesting, but most of them just don't make sense. The first thing that caught my eye was Cut the Rope. If you were born any year before 2015, you definitely know what Cut the Rope is. I feel like, honestly, this is gonna have to be one of the best, best games I've seen so far because this is just a classic. I wanna see if I can get to any of these levels where I'm stuck on because as a kid, I feel like this game was pretty easy, so it can't be that much harder. As I continued to play the game, I was doing really good, really wasn't making too many mistakes, and I thought this was really impressive until I looked it up and the game was rated 5 plus. I feel like 5 year old me is just really impressed by what I'm doing right now. I mean right now, probably not so much, because I am a grown ass man, playing a game, presumably made for kids. I'm just gonna keep it real guys, I don't, I don't want you guys to be blinded by nostalgia, but this game's pretty boring. <laughs> Wait, I'm already almost done with it. I might as well just go through the whole thing then. A few inches later. Oh, there's multiple worlds. Okay, I thought I was gonna finish the whole thing right here, but oh my god. Yeah, I mean, I did the whole world, 10 minutes, you know. One, two, three, four, five. You could probably get like a good hour out of this game. That being integrated in YouTube, I think that's a pretty good deal. I feel like a lot of people are blinded by nostalgia with this game. If I didn't play this game in the past when I was like growing up on like my tablet, I would probably rate this pretty low. I already hear the hate coming from y'all, but I'm gonna give it a six out of 10, dude. All right, on to our next one. Let's find another game we're gonna play. You know what? Let's play My Mini Marts. And I'm, I'm hesitant to play some of these games because I feel like a lot of them kind of just look like those mobile ads where it's like the stupid guy like, oh, we're gonna get it. We're gonna get the turret. Oh man, we almost got the turret. Oh, oh, there's another one. Oh, oh. Like those ads are the most stupid shit ever. But yeah, here we go. We're doing, we're doing, a, we're doing a game that's not gonna piss me off because it's gonna be an amazing game. Okay, I need four dollars. Yep, four dollars collected. Wait, how much money do I have? Wait, I have so much money at the top right. What's the point of even? Okay, general rule of thumb. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give at least each game five minutes, so I give them all a fair chance. And if it doesn't interest me in the next five minutes, then the game's doo doo. One out of 10, for sure. That was way worse than the other game. It's just mind numbing. Overall, I think the average score of the game so far, and we're only three deep, is probably like three or four out of 10. It's not looking too good. Right now, loading up the best game of all time. It's run many awards throughout the country. Emoji puzzle, the best game you've never heard of. All right, uh, yawning, sleeping, kissing, love, mass sickness. Yeah. There's 140 levels of this game. Actually, there might even be 150 levels in this game. Zero out of 10. Zero out of 10. Come on, YouTube. What are we doing here? Look at it. 
I'm losing hope, guys. I'm, I'm really losing hope. Next game we got. I think this one's got hope. It's called Paper.io. Oh my god, it's a mouse! Oh yeah, you thought. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. I died. So it's like snake. Give me that. Where's he at? Where's he at? Where's he at? Boom. Give me those. I wonder if I could if I could just keep going and not die. Is it? Oh no, that's not. Yeah, I'm not even having fun anymore, man. Oh, no, am, I, am I just ass at this game? Give me those. Come here. You don't know what to do. You don't know what to do. Alright, I'm done. Zero out of ten. No, I'll give it a two out of ten. It's all just brain rot games, dude. Alright, now this. This right here is a banger. Hill Climb Racing Light. I used to play this game back in middle school. No, not even middle school. I used to play this game back in elementary school, dude. So I know for sure that this is going to be a banger and it's not going to disappoint me like the other games have been. So there's two controls. There's a gas and then there's the brakes. Seems pretty simple. And you know why? It's because it is. Something simple, yet not mind-numbing. Because there is a little bit of strategy into it. And it's just like... I don't know, this game just hits, like, the controls are kind of wonky on computer, I feel like I should have done this on my phone. But this game is one of the GOATs, in my opinion, of the entire app store. Oh shit. Oh god damn it. I broke my neck. I got bread though. Hey look, after you get bread, you can upgrade it. Yo shit, bro, you can upgrade your shit. And this one's kind of mind-numbing, and it definitely is, there is some nostalgia behind it that I'm like holding on to. But it's better than the emoji battles, I'll tell you that. My monkey brain just sees, like, cars driving. And like off-roading in game, and I'm just like, yes, this is this is peak. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah! Uh, are you kidding me, dude? I didn't even break my neck, bro. I barely touched it. Guy's weak. He deserves a broken neck. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh my god, dude! Every time I die, I pull something up. It's stupid. There's so much to do in this game. There's multiple worlds. I mean, I've played it a lot. I probably have like over like 50 hours of this game in my entire life. So I'm a little biased, but I don't really care. I, I, it's my video. What are y'all going to do to me? 8 out of 10. Nah, 9 out of 10. This is the best game so far. All right, so you may be wondering why I'm in a different hood. No! All right, you're, you're, my fault. We're going to do one more game. And instead of just picking one based off of what I think, I'm just going to do a random number generator so it's a bit more like random. Uh, we'll do 1 through 80. And then I'll scroll that many games down to see what we get. So let's see what we get. 60. All right. Let me count down 60 real quick. And the last game we're going to be playing is Flappy Dunk. My cats are being so annoying, dude. They keep meowing. Hold on. Let me let them in. I just want to be annoying. Here, say hi. Say hi. Hi. How are you? All right. She's purring. So y'all know, know I don't abuse her. All right. <laughs> the last game we're going to be playing today is called Flappy Dunk. I guess it's like Flappy Bird or something. I don't know. I mean, I'm just going off the title. All right, don't touch the ceiling. Don't touch the floor. Tap to jump. Oh, okay, I get it. Can I go from under or no? Oh, no. I guess I can't. Okay, wait, I kind of like this because you have to like get swishes. It, it involves a little bit of skill. Okay, okay. Persephone, you're, you're, me you're messing up the flow. Okay, don't. Stop, stop. Melody, you Bro, I'm trying to record a video. What are y'all doing, man? Are you... Ladies, are you serious? Are y'all... Alright, are y'all for real? They're trying to hit the the basketball. Y'all can't see it, but there's... Alright, y'all done. I love my cats, but they're annoying. Alright. I'm gonna try and get up to 100. And when I get to 100, I think I'll call it there. I forgot I can't touch the top, dude. But if you guys are enjoying the video so far, please subscribe. Uh, I'm trying to hit 500 subs by the end of October. Wait, this game is like oddly addicting. I feel like Flappy Bird was really infuriating and it made me not want to play it, but this one is like, this one just seems more smooth than Flappy Bird for sure. No. Oh, no. Ah, I messed up. Ah. Oh, I didn't even tap, dude. Oh, my skibbity sigma, dude. There it is. No, I didn't mean to tap. <laughs> Come on. Okay, that's right. If I just take it slow. Okay. Yep. The more I start talking, I just. Nope. Oh, oh, oh. Dude, was that not inside? Alright, let's see. Why did it tap so late? Dude, my finger's cramping, man. I'm actually liking this game a lot. I don't know why I am. It's so stupid, but like, it's fun. I'm gonna change my channel to a Flappy Hoops channel. Never mind. Oh. 
this game, dude. 40 away from 100. Easily doable. I'm about to tweak out. Squidward! Squidward! Oh, you can't stop me now. I'm on a roll. No. No! Dude, I'm getting way too invested in this game. How long have I been recording? I've been on this game for 25 minutes. Are you fucking kidding me? Dude, why am I so addicted to this? So I was tweaking out. I was playing this game for like 30 minutes straight. And I was seriously getting frustrated. So I'm just gonna skip to uh, skip to the W, honestly. Come on, give me a switch so it's easier. That's a switch, yep. Oh my god, that could have been it. Okay, three more, three more. I got it, bro, I got it. Oh my god, this is it. This is it. Oh, bro, I'm at 97 again. This is, the, this is the attempt directly after y'all. Oh my god, I made it! I made it! Now screw that, I'm not playing anymore. Oh my god, finally. But this one's actually pretty cool. Um, Now for the rating, I'm gonna be honest. I'm, I'm gonna give it a little eight. I'm gonna give it, now I'll even give it an eight and a half. So yeah guys, that's gonna be the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. And Nigga, if you don't get out my setup, what is you doing over here? This is my channel. Get out of here. Get out of here, right? Okay, I'm sorry. Come on, come on. Get, the, get the fuck out of here. I don't even know who that guy is, bro. But yeah, that's pretty much going to conclude the video. Thank you guys so much for making it to the end of the video. If you made it this far, comment your first, last name, social security number, and phone number so I know how exactly to contact you. No, I'm just playing. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to have some more videos coming up soon. I'm just finishing. I'm moving. But yeah, thank you guys so much. I'll catch y'all later. Peace.